What if I told you that there is an open source library that can generate photorealistic pictures and also generate really good text. It's not stable diffusion, it's not DALI, it's not mid-journey. It's a completely new model from a team called Deep Floyd, very surprisingly or unsurprisingly, funded by stability.ai. They have tried to recreate the paper from Google. So if you know that Google sometime back introduced a model called Imagine, it's a text to image diffusion model. But the point here is an unprecedented degree of photorealism and deep level of language understanding. Inherently, it uses T5 models and that's exactly what this team has tried to do. They have tried to use that or replicate that paper and try to recreate a new model called IF. It's a model from a team called Deep Floyd, so it's called Deep Floyd IF. The good thing about this model, before even I get into details is, you can manage to fit this model within the free tier of Google Collab. So if you have a free tier of Google Collab, you would be able to run this model at some capacity I do not know what is the level of clarity and details that you can get in the free version of Google Collab for this model. But as you can see, the RAM, VRAM requirements, the 16 gig VRAM can fit if I Excel model. So that's a, a 64 by 64 base module. And also you have got a 256 by 256 upscaler module. But if you want, the, the upscaler of 1024 by 1024 then you need 24 gig VRAM and what is the model the how does the model architecture looks like you can see when you give the text so that goes to a frozen T5XXL model and uh, that generates a 64 by 64 image and that gets upscaled into a 256 by 256 image and then finally that gets upscaled into a 1024 by 1024 image and you can see all the details about the models what happens in every single architecture all these details are provided here now the model is not just i mean when you say deep floyd it's not just this is like the first time the entire world is seeing deep floyd has been in um, a discord group for quite some time i've been part of the discord group i never got access to it but i've always seen this and got like myself surprised by looking at the quality of text that it can produce look at these images any image that you look at here it like produces brilliant like absolutely brilliant images and you can see the details that it has got, the skin tone that it has got, the text that it does and the language understanding. That's one of the things that the paper from Google has highlighted that Imagine as a model has got really good understanding of the text, which means you don't have to really make an extensive or great prompt engineering skills to create a really good image and you can read about the paper here like you can see um, a cute corgi lives in a house made of sushi and this is the image that you got and you can see that sprouts in the shape of text image and coming out of a fairy tale book image when image was launched almost everybody's mind was blown because until that point we had not seen this level of language understanding and we have not seen text understanding but this model was never open sourced by Google sadly but thanks to a group of researchers and also probably stability AI for giving them the funding that now we have a working model that is that can run in the free Google Collab that can be integrated or that's already integrated with Hugging Face Diffuses which is one of the most popular Python library to access and generate stable diffusion images which means very soon you might see this model and the model um, usage within a popular UI like Auto 11.11 and a lot of other codes are already being shared with you how you can use this model 
what are the type of things that you can do the first thing that you can do is you can dream the very basic text to image model the second thing that you can do is a zero shot image to image translation you can take one image and then translate into another image the next thing that you can do is you can always upscale the image so you can take an existing image and then upscale the image and then the next thing that you can do is you can do zero shot in painting you can take a photo like this and do in painting without without any fine tuning or few shot learning so zero shot um, in painting is also possible the model details are released here uh, when i made this video the model was not publicly shared and for you to access the model in itself you need to have you need to do certain things first when the model is being shared you need to have a hugging face account you need to log in and make sure that you are logged into your hugging face account so and then you need to go to the model page and then accept the license it's getting um, released with a very different license we'll explore that probably in some other video but after you do that you will be able to access the model whether on google collab whether on locally in your machine but it looks like it's uh, it's completely new image and was never released so i'm quite surprised and also very happy to see this model because i've been waiting for a very long time to get access to this model and I've, I've, I've even cold dm people who never responded to give me access but now the fact that this model is coming to everybody's hands is uh, unbelievable and i'm quite excited to see what this model is going to do and how this model is even licensed like i'm also interested in seeing how this model is licensed and um, how this is going to take off so special thanks to stability ai and its ceo imad mustak for invaluable support gpt compute and infrastructure to train the models thanks to lion for the data set and all these things so it's uh, it's quite interesting to see how this model is going to play out given the current ecosystem of models um, every other model or every other model that has been built on stable diffusion was not based on this kind of architecture so we have completely new brand new image text to image architecture that is quite exciting and also interesting to see how the ecosystem is going to play out after this deep floyd if is an exciting space let me know what do you think about this model but i would most likely create hands on tutorial about how to use this model on your google collab or paid gpu to generate images and do other state of the art text to image model activities see you in another video happy prompting